This is the first movement from the general strength series. This is a single leg vertical jump. So we have a single leg reactive jump done earlier in the week, the difference between these two. On the single leg vertical jump, what we want to do is to load the leg and trunk position more. So instead of being a tall athletic, we're what I would characterize now in a, in a low athletic position. So step into that foot. Now you're gonna really bend from the knee, ankle, and hip together. Release that rear foot and then push and reach for maximum length from that position. So this one's far more difficult. It's gonna take a longer time. It's really critical that as you extend, no matter how slow it feels like that movement goes, you keep pushing, pushing, pushing until you hit one straight line with your arms, with your trunk, with your legs. That's the only way we'll create power in this position. And it's one of the unique ways that we can create overload in the absence of additional load via weights and extra jumping velocities which we're trying to reserve for later training as we move closer to our competitive seasons. So again, on the opposite foot, this is the one that I'll generally struggle with, my weak foot. Step into that foot, load from the ankle, knee and hip, chest is down over the knee, arms back, push and reach as long and as strong as you can until you complete the desired number of reps.